Hey, everybody, and welcome to Lifestyle Today. I'm Justine Santanello. It's officially the last episode of our holiday episodes. I cannot believe it, but don't worry. We have plenty of last-minute holiday tips for you guys. But before we get into all that, I thought that it would be fun to think ahead to New Year's Eve. So, designer Stacy Garcia is with us today to help give us a little help that we need to put together our New Year's Eve tablescapes. I am super excited. First of all, welcome. Thank you so much. This is so fun. I feel like, you know, I'm really prepped here. I feel like I'm at a party. I do too. I'm waiting for the ball to drop. (sighs) Me too. I'm waiting for my glass of champagne. We'll have that at the end. Oh, for sure. So before we even get into all of this, can you tell us a little bit more how you got how you got into all of this and where we can find you now. For sure. So I'm a designer by training. Okay. I've spent 25 years of my career developing products for hotels and resorts <gasps> Love it. around the world. And then okay. what I did is I had so much fun designing all of those products yeah. that I created a shop about a year ago. That's so we so have shopstacygarcia.com. Love it. Where we curate some fabulous designer products okay. um, and things that really are near and dear to my heart okay. and with my fun aesthetic. So okay. that's well, what we're showing off here. This is definitely a fun aesthetic. So New Year's Eve, tell us, what is it all about? Was there a logic that went into this or are you just so talented that you just threw this in? There you go. I have a great team. So I'll give them a plug also. So thank you to my talented team (laughs) and to all the people who play along on social media with us and ask us for our tips. So I get asked all the time, how do you style a great looking table? Like what is it that makes a designer tablescape, right? Whether it's Christmas or New Year's or whatever your holiday is, there's Mm -hmm. a couple of tips. Okay. So one of the first things that I want to focus on is pick a theme. Okay. Okay. So pick a theme. You have to like, you know, have something to anchor your statement around. Yes. What is our theme? My theme here I'm calling Global Meets Glam. (gasps) Okay. Global Meets Glam. So that's what I'm playing with here. Okay. And so what I wanted to do here was mix it up. So I picked some um, really beautiful handmade items. So these are bowls that we purchased from a company called Amsha. These are on my shop. Okay. These are all handmade by women in Africa. Ooh. So these actually sustain women in their villages in Africa. They are absolutely beautiful. Gorgeous. Each one really truly is one of a kind and made by ham. Okay. So they're not only beautiful, but they are meaningful. Sure. I think they make great hostess gifts also. Yes, I love them. But I love the pattern. I love how modern they are. Mm-hmm. And I love that they add that kind of natural texture. Yes. Okay, so that's part of my global story. Okay. And then my glam is the metal. So I'm mixing metals. I have Love. gold and silver. And then I threw a little bit of whimsy in. Yes. So you can see I threw some disco balls. So I'm, I'm like, obsessed. have fun. Have yes. fun with your tablescape. There's no, you know, we're in our shimmer yeah. and shine. Why not throw a little whimsy in yes. there? So that's my number one tip is pick your theme. Okay. And then I also added velvet for my glam effect. So yes. this is a very special fabric. This is called Krypton. Okay. And this actually comes from the hospitality industry. Oh. But we do a line that we sell at Calico stores. And what's really oh. cool about this, and I can just kind of show it off. I don't have um, my napkins here, but I can show it off. I'm going to just pour this because normally you wouldn't want to do that. It beads up like mercury. Get so really here. cool. You can, yeah, and you can, don't have to do a tablecloth. You can go, you know, to a store, you can go online and you can purchase fabric and layer your table however you want. Okay. Um, obsessed so that you can actually have fun as the hostess and not worry about that. Totally. Yes. Amazing. So this okay. is from our Krypton line. And then my next tip is to add varying heights. Okay. So you yes. really want to make sure that your eye has a place to kind of bounce around the table. It yeah. really makes it interesting. So we did these high candlesticks. These are also from our shop, Stacey Garcia. Beautiful. And we paired them with these vases. And what I love about the vases is they also function as hurricane glasses. So you can actually put a candle in there too. Okay. But look at how great we're sort of mixing the heights and varying the heights, varying the textures, playing off of our theme. And then texture is my third tip. So you want to make sure that you have a variety of texture, yes. not only in your tablescape, sort of, you know, whether it's your bar, mixing your materials, okay. mixing the shiny with some of the naturals, right. but also in your food. So think about how you're presenting huh. your food. Okay. And so we went with these like really chunky grainy breads mm. mixed with some of these juicy grapes yes. and really tried to layer texture within our tablescape. All right. So you will come to my house. Yes, All right. of course. You decorate. I'll feed you. I was going to say, who's bringing the bubbly? I'll have that. Okay. I'll have that. (laughs) This was awesome. All right, you guys, we will be right back.